Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. Sorry, there's some stuff in the way. Turner's Variety Channel. Um, I'm excited to do this video for you guys. So, over... What was it? Today's Friday. So, last two days ago, Wednesday, Bath & Body Works had a single wick candle sale. And I decided to pick up a couple of fall single wicks. And I'm also going to show you um, a summer single wick that I happened to get that I don't think I've ever showed you guys. So... It's going to be a shorter video, probably, but I just wanted to share my haul, so here we go. So, the first single wick that I want to show you guys, that actually I did not get at the sale I got several months ago, i just been too lazy to show it to you guys, um, is none other than uh, the classic Fiji White Sands, and I apologize for the glare again. I'm hoping that'll, like, show up. Fiji White Sands, it's, it's, it's a nice one. I have it in a, I'm pointing to it, a large three-wick candle, so this one is, they have put the notes on the single wicks now, by the way, I've noticed that they've done that for like the past year or whatever. Um, fresh cut sugar cane, white nectarine, and sandalwood with natural essential oils, all of them have essential oils. It, it's your classic sandy, beachy fragrance. Although, we are starting to get to fall. Today's actually September 1st. Yeah, today's September 1st. I cannot believe that, you guys. September. September is here, you guys. Cooler weather is coming. The leaves are going to be changing. Fall is going to be here. And obviously, Halloween, everybody's favorite, is coming soon. So, but yeah, this is a good, like, kind of summery one. I'll, I probably, I might burn it soon, or I might just wait until next spring to burn it because I'm going to be probably burning a couple of fall and winter candles so it's, it's like seasonally appropriate but this one's like a good beachy one like perfect for summertime so there's that one all right so the four single wicks the first one I'm going to show you I kind of cheated and burned it already today because I wanted to like burn a fall candle and um I'm sorry you guys I know I should have waited to burn, burn it until I showed you guys but it's all right I'm still going to, like, smell it and tell you about it. Um, pumpkin peanut brittle. I love the packaging. Now, if you like peanut butter, you are really going to like this smell. Mmm. It, it, I actually just burned it out, so it kind of is, like, I think the wax is hard. Yeah, the wax is kind of hardened. I just can tell I burned it. I love this one. I, you know, I initially I didn't think I was going to like it because I'm not really, like, a... Like, a big fan of, like, peanut or peanut butter scented, like, things, but this one is crunchy caramel brittle. I definitely get the caramel. Salty peanuts and toasted pumpkin seeds. To me, it smells like pumpkin with peanut butter. I'm, that's all I'm gonna say. It's really good. Obviously, this kind of has, like, a burnt smell now to it because I burned it, but if, on cold, it's, like, really good. And, and this one... Since I burned, I can tell you how it performs. This one will fill your room up. This one's a strong one. I don't want to say it's a powerhouse. Like, it's not like, whoa, like, knock you off your feet strong. It's like, it's like a pleasant strong, if that makes sense. Um, so, yeah. Pumpkin peanut brittle. Yeah. This one's a good one, you guys, for fall. I definitely would recommend picking this up. It was actually kind of cool out today, so it was kind of nice to burn. A fall one and getting, like, the pumpkin fall spirit. Hey, I have so much trouble putting these lids on, you guys. It's, like, not even funny. All right. Next, I have leaves. This is a classic. I have told you guys about leaves and my channel in body care form. And, uh, yeah. Uh, leaves is crisp red apple, golden nectar, and warm clove spice. And as you guys know, this is my all-time favorite fall. Oh, man, that's so good, you guys leaves i you guys got it i'm telling you you guys have to get leaves it's seriously so good although if you sorry just a dog barking outside my window's actually open so you might hear that actually hold on i'm gonna close my window so you guys can't hear it one sec all right hopefully that's better that there's some dog that like literally like every night at like 10 10 o'clock at night like literally like without fail will start barking its head off i don't know why I think it might be, we might have actually coyotes in the back, so, yeah. Anyway, leaves. Leaves is amazing. It's definitely apple cinnamon, 
The clove is pretty strong in there, so if you guys aren't really a huge fan of clove, you might not like this one, but I, I love it, and I think most people will really like this one. Mmm, it's so good. It's a, it's a fall classic. You must get leaves, you guys. Okay, so next, I'm going to talk about Harvest Pomegranate. I love the picture on the label of, like, the fall tree and the sun rising in the background. It's such a pretty label. Whoever took that picture, amazing. Um, Harvest Pomegranate. This one is Rich Pomegranate, Freshly Picked Apple and Sweet Black Plum. This one is strong on cold. This one's definitely... It's definitely fruity. It's a pomegranate. I definitely get the plum... And I do actually get a little bit of apple, so I smell all three scent notes mentioned. Now, sometimes if you know, if you rub your finger on the wax, you can kind of get a sense of, like, what it's going to, like, smell like burning. Um, but, yeah, um, this one's amazing. Although, this one, to me, is kind of like a late summer, early fall scent. Like, when it's kind of still warm, it hasn't gotten, like, cool yet, and the leaves quite haven't changed. Haven't quite changed, excuse me. This one, I think I probably will start burning soon, because I, again, this one's more of, like, a late summer, like, like, early September, like, late August, well, I just said today's September 1st, so August is over until next year, but, yeah. This one I actually might start burning soon. As for leaves, I definitely think leaves is, like, uh, I'm probably burning when it, like, cools down. Like, it's supposed to get, like, in the 90s where I live, so I'm not gonna be burning leaves when it's 90 degrees out. If that makes sense. So yeah, that one's definitely a definitely a fruity pomegranate uh, apple with like a little bit of like sweet plum. It's definitely yeah, it's it's uh, definitely good in there. So okay, I hate these lids. I swear I, they so hard to get on sometimes. I'm gonna put these back up here where I keep them. And um, we have one more to talk about. Actually, two more. I'm going to actually show you a Yankee Candle that I got the other day that I just wanted to try for funsies. But, alright, so the last one, Bath & Body Works Single Wick, is Pumpkin Bonfire. I'm surprised this has an acorn on it, considering it's called Pumpkin Bonfire. I would think it would maybe have, like, a pile of logs, like, on fire or something. Uh, this one, oh, I can smell it, is White Pumpkin. A bundle of clove buds and glowing embers. This one is definitely a fire. It smells like someone like put a pumpkin in a bonfire. Hence the name. It's so good. It's you definitely get the pumpkin, but you also get that like smoky, like deep smoky scent to it. It's like a good smoky scent, though. It's like it's like a fireplace almost. Or a bonfire. You definitely get those embers in there. This one definitely, to me, is a Halloween candle. I would totally burn this, like, near Halloween. You know? Like, this would be a good one if, like, if you're having, like, a Halloween party. You could, like, burn this during the party. Yeah, this one's really good. Um, I do like this one a lot. Pumpkin bonfire. I am excited to burn this, but again, I'll probably wait till close to Halloween. Because it's definitely like a fiery, smoky pumpkin. So, that one is really good. That dog is still barking, or that coyote. I don't know what it is, but I can still hear it going off out there. Alright, and the one Yankee candle I wanted to share with you guys. These were on sale. I forget how much they were. They were like $15? Maybe they were like 50% off. I don't know. But, I went in, and the lady's like, what do you like? I'm like, I like anything fruity. I really like pineapple. So, I'm trying out their classic pineapple cilantro. I have not burned it yet. It is one wick. Um, let me see if I can find out what it smells like. It doesn't say. I'm gonna try and tell you what it smells like through my nose. Okay, I- it's definitely pineapple with like an herby finish. Which is probably the cilantro. This one's amazing, you guys. I cannot wait to light this one up. Although, again, this one's more of a summer fragrance, so I might just will keep it and hold on, hold on to it, 
and burn it like next summer or spring like when it gets warm again i mean it's still warm out but this one's amazing it's definitely pineapple-y hint of cilantro or hint of herbiness it's perfect you guys i would definitely recommend picking this one up all right you guys that is all for today um, I'm still going to review those other fall fragrances from Bath and Body Works. I just haven't had the time because college has started for me and I'm about to start my job up again. So I'm going to try and get more videos in for you guys like often. But just please know if I don't post for several days or weeks at a time, I am alive. I am fine. I'm just really busy, you guys. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please subscribe. Give it a like. Give it a comment. And I will see you guys next time. Bye-bye, everybody.